this should be interesting moving forward. I've given up on Jenna Beck. I don't trust her. She didn't interact once with anything that I came up with in regards to Echo Park. She said nice catch with the teleprompter stuff. But I don't see her tweeting about it. I don't see her helping me out one bit. I might have to make shorter videos to separate topics. I've got new footage from Echo Park. I got that in high definition. That'll be the video after this one. I don't want to make a big deal out of why I no longer trust Jenna Beck. I mean, I never really trust her at all. I only just met these people over the last several months. I'm not going to get bogged down with why I don't trust her because she is low-lying fruit, as is uh, the person she claimed uh, all those things about him. And I'm just trying to ignore that guy. But I didn't like the way she made fun of him being homeless. She made fun of him having to eat 10-year-old food out of her cupboard. She made fun of ordering food for one, takeout, having it delivered, and then having him watch her eat it or watching him go into the cupboard for the 10-year-old crackers. I think she's just making all that stuff up. I'm starting to think they're just whatever. They're handed up. She keeps getting Grissom's name wrong. Grissom. I just got his name wrong because she keeps doing that. His name's Brisson, but she keeps saying it's Grissom. This isn't like myself saying Chandra, because that woman went uh, Norm Chomsky. I mean, I ended up saying Norm Chomsky once. These people are trying to throw us off track. They're trying to uh, frame us into not knowing uh, Norm's true first name. I don't trust uh, Jeff Miami Campbell. I think Campbell's his last name. Some guy at Twitter, he's going way into lack of humility. Phil, he thinks it's all about himself. He's just another one of those leading us down the wrong path, whether he's in on it or he's compromised by his own ego. I just want to be left alone by Jenna Beck. I want to be left alone because she didn't interact with any of that Echo Park stuff. That is gaslighting. There's no way around it. She is gaslighting me by not doing anything about my major scoops. She did nothing. She didn't even interact with me over any of it. I go over to the Twitter today. There's still nothing really there. She said she notified Jeff Campbell about myself, but what I found, but uh, there's no proof. She's lying. She doesn't seem to have really much of a following at all, but I don't care. She's from Orange County. Good luck being a burn bot in Orange County. Everyone knows that's a right-wing bill. She's saying she worked in IT most of her life. Is that supposed to make people trust her more? She said she worked in data centers. It's just more of that Defango type crap. So that's what I'm doing right here, distancing myself from her. Because she's done nothing with uh, what I came up with. And it's not that I'm bitter that I'm being ignored by everyone, but... The people who lurk my channel. And I, I like you guys. Thanks for doing that. Thanks for bumping up the uh, subscriber total. Thanks for uh, hearing me out. I hate to say hearing me out. They're trying to own every freaking word. They're gaslighting us. Uh, Franco Analysis had some podcasts before this one. He only showed up a year ago. Now he's doing these big interviews with Dor. Trying to talk fast for some reason. Because I'm excited. I've got Network News affiliates from Los Angeles have their chopper footage of Johnny and Glory in the police area. So that'll be in uh, follow-up videos. I already nailed them with, uh, using a teleprompter. Unfortunately, you can't really... I couldn't. I can't see if there are any words on it. I flipped the image, though. You can see, if you go to the previous video I cranked out last night, that one shows uh, Glory with what she really looks like. I flip the image back. She always like reverses the image. Jenna Beck does that too. I don't trust that one bit. But anyway, uh, to get to this video, because I want to keep the topic separate, sort of moving forward, and to be more focused, I have this tweet. I want to go over it. She retweeted Ben Dixon. Now, Ben Dixon... I had a big falling out with him on Twitter. We had an argument going back and forth. 
I don't know if I have that saved. I mean, I do have my Twitter stuff saved, but it's such a hassle, and what's the point? I used to be a big-time burn bot. Not humongous, but I was there. I participated. I'm not going back there. No way. Jenna says, go, go there yourself and talk to that guy. F that. Enough people have seen what I came up with that it either goes viral or it's just more proof that everything's rigged. I was uh, out in the open with my stuff on Camberlin and still got no viral support except uh, off record I talked with Mark Singer. I mean, there was proof from these people. Joe Loria from Consortium News called me up, but even then it didn't go viral. So I don't expect what I came up with on Combo Couch to go viral either. But I do have that new footage and I'm going to keep plugging away. I'm going to stop watching those shows. I'm going to stop observing their tardy dyskinesia because it was proven. I don't have to listen to them. I don't have to watch them. You got fake opposition watching their every move now. Except for the moves that truly matter, like working for police at Echo Park. They won't cover that. They won't cover proving that they're all reading off of scripts with the teleprompters. They could have two, three, four, or five of those in a room. Just look for their eyes. Look for how much they've memorized versus when they're looking down and they're looking at the box and what's the next idea, the next sentence or two. Just watch the eyes. Sometimes they say follow the money. I'm saying follow the eyes. And you'll see that they're all in the teleprompter. So Ben Dixon, he's another one of those, I was going to say Kim Iverson, but no, he's not nearly as obvious. Well, he is really sort of obvious that he's part of the ecosystem, but he comes from more from the Jank Ugar side. He didn't branch off with the door. He branched off into like this independent, more like an H.A. Goodman or David Pakman, that type of the ecosystem. H.A. Goodman uh, has more entanglement. Jamal Thomas has more entanglement with the past. Tim Black entanglement. Maybe we should go into some entanglement theory someday. They try to entangle us. They don't like it when we're free like a Christian Marty thinking for ourselves. They don't like it when we hear out the speaker as a friend and then we follow through with what the teacher, well, the speaker told us of what he was experiencing. So, yeah, we have uh, this Ben Dixon guy who's an obvious paid fake. I noticed that he's no longer on screen. I had to go back a month to find him. I'm going to take a few clips here and there, and hopefully I can add uh, one of those uh, Tokyo Shemp live stream kind of things where there's no editing. I'm just watching it and observing it. I'll observe it first. I'll study it first. I'll pre-select the stuff. And then I'll try to present it. I just want to show that Ben Dixon is reading off of the teleprompter. Same as a Glory. There are, they all are. It's not just Glory Jones. So this is the person, one of the people that Jenna Beck is retweeting. I'm done with her. I don't need attention. I don't need a friend. I don't need a cohort unless someone is qualified for this sort of blogging. Only if they're consistent. Yeah, the ecosystem uh, keeps throwing out the word, the idea of consistency. They're trying to own every word. That's why I'm going to stop watching them. Because they're gaslighting everyone. You hear that thing I picked out from Steve Poinkinen in the previous video? He's talking about how you take it's all scripted in the same cadence. They're gaslighting. That scoop this, scoop that, scoopy scoop, scoop, gang scoop. That's gaslighting on me, period. So yeah, that's about enough audio for this video, and I'll just take a few excerpts from Ben Dixon to prove that he's reading off a monitor. This is from uh, a month or so ago. And then the real work, the real fun, will come in the next video when we take a closer look at police informants, Convo Coach, who were working for the cops at Echo Park. I recommend everyone, uh, if we can keep a schedule, if someone can keep tabs on them when they're having their public protests, we should come together as 
anyone out there with integrity who's into internet meta anyone who wants to get involved we will start a group we should start a group we'll get them on film if anyone wants to we'll reverse it you know how uh what's his face uh Rutkowski used to fake approach uh powerful people and interview them on the spot michael moore's known for doing that well that's what we should do to the convo couch and to point it in but i don't exactly trust people who are not dealing with the exact scoops that i come up with that's all i'm saying i'll just add some uh, generic phrases to add in for when i noticed dixon looking down at the monitor Looking down at the monitor. Not just America. <laughs> but in that day, that day, that next morning, I realized that because of so many states, so many nations across Looking the globe, Looking down at the monitor. Looking down at the monitor. You don't have to be afraid of tornadoes devastating. Looking down at the monitor. They have to be afraid of drone strikes, airstrikes. At any moment, their home could be hit with an airstrike. And to hear that Palestinian mother say that she had to put Looking her down at the monitor with her because Looking she didn't down at want the to leave monitor. anyone to mourn. And Looking I get down at it. the I monitor. That sentiment. But to have to make that decision for what? Looking down at the monitor. What? Land? For land? For property? Looking down at the For monitor. What? A political ideology? No, seriously, down let's go down the, the list. Monitor. What is worth Looking down at the putting monitor. another Looking down human at the being? Monitor. I don't care. I don't... You, you want to ask me about numbers? It, it, Looking it, down what at number, the monitor. What, what's the threshold? No human being should have to go through what the Palestinian people are going through right now. No human being should have to go with what a Yemeni father has to go through right now, Looking unable to feed his monitor. children. His children are emaciated because of a blockade. For what? The political power of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia? Looking the down at the I monitor. Get, Looking down at the, the monitor. The more radical I get, people say you get more conservative the older you get. No, 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 baby. Have children, and you'll see how radical it turns you. Looking down at the monitor. Because there's not a single Looking down at person the on the face of the planet who should be going through this. Looking down at the monitor. And we have it in our capacity. Looking down stop. at the monitor. That's the thing. That's the kicker. It's not as though. Looking down at it's the not monitor. as though we can't. This is some mystery. Looking down at the monitor. That is completely unsolvable. We have it in our capacity. Looking to down stop at the this. monitor. And yet. Looking down at the, the United monitor. States right now is just quiet. Looking down at the monitor. Looking down at the monitor. The United States right now is just quiet. Looking down at the monitor. Looking down at the monitor. I'm gonna play this clip. Looking and this down clip at the is from monitor. Middle Eastern Eye. Looking down at the monitor. And I shared it earlier on YouTube. I, I shared Looking it down at the monitor. Because it's not only the parents. Looking down at the monitor. But it's children. Listen to Looking this down at the monitor. Girl, as she describes. Looking down at the monitor. She's incapable. Looking of down at the this. monitor. And as Looking you down at the monitor. <laughs> that we are capable of fixing this. Looking down at the monitor. Looking down at the monitor. <laughs> 